Hey guys, welcome back. So uh, today's May 2nd. Um, yeah, you probably won't see this till later on, like somewhere around. I don't even know when you'll see this, but you'll see this way later. Again, my videos are pre-recorded, so yeah. Um, today I've got some cheese fries. I was going to get regular fries, but for some weird reason I was craving the cheese. So this is it. Looks so yummy, doesn't it guys? Yummy, yummy, scrumptious. Mmm, let's take a bite. Yum. This time, they did give me a fork. Which is nice. Mm hmm yum. I do have forks from McDonald's, luckily. From a while back. Some, you know when they give you for like nachos and stuff or whatever. Look at this, you guys. So beautiful. I think today I did like last time I checked 1.5 miles, which is nice. And like 6,000 steps, I think was it, or 4,000 steps. I think 4,000. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. So good. If I remember, I'll include the pictures of how much I walked, the miles, and then the uh app or the steps look at that mm -hmm. put like your eye there that was not a fart I should open this window sorry radio mm. I haven't had curly fries fries like cheese fries and forever this is so good I've been using this app sweat coin I don't know apparently you can get paid for while well, for like walking or something I don't know how it works but Apparently, since I've downloaded it, I have like I think twenty four dollars. I forgot about the app for a while because I have like you know with iPhones how you can make groups and put all apps into like one group. So I have like exercise apps, I have a shopping app, and all that stuff. So I tend to forget about it. So I'm gonna take all those out and start organizing them so I can like every time I swipe through my phone, I remember I have the app and actually use it. You know? Yum. Just look at that before I bite it. See that beautifulness? Mm -hmm. Totally hits the spot. I was out with a friend today. Mm -hmm. Whoops. <gasps> We just hung out at the beach. That's a little baby. I didn't get any like footage, like video while there, just because I forgot. I don't know. And it's been a while since me and her hung out, so I didn't feel like a camera was really needed. Fuck! Did they really give me three forks? Did they? Oh, I think because they saw me hanging out with like her and her boyfriend was with us at the at the end before they had to leave so maybe they thought I got the food for all of us I don't know <clears throat> so I just got this no cheeseburger I watched earthlings cause Chantel if you guys watch Chantel vlogs I think that's her channel name now I don't know but she also used to do mukbangs. And she still, I think she still does them from time to time, but like healthier ones. And on her like last three videos, um, she posted, she was talking about earthlings and she posted a link. And I watched it in the living with my mom. I cried the instant they put 
like the dogs and cats and animal shelter. I cried throughout the whole thing, but I was watching it with my mom and my stepdad, and it just, it made me sad. It was the saddest thing ever, you guys. I really want to stop eating meat. You know? Or, at least, like, because I want to, but then also, I'm just starting to like sandwiches with meat. Like, I mean, not with meat, with, like, vegetables in them. So they're starting to taste good with vegetables, so I don't know yet what I want to do. I don't know. Um, I want to see maybe if I can do it for 30 days and see how that was for me, you know. So good. Guys, the whole work thing has been pretty crazy. Like, I don't even know. But it's been intense. Usually I don't take such huge... It's not a really big bite, but it's for a long. For what I'm used to. My chair is squeaky, sorry. You know, I don't know. It's they're very confusing, so making me not want to work there anymore. We'll talk about that in another video, I guess. Uh huh. This is so good. I'm so glad that they gave me a fork. Even though I have my own butt. Because I think last time I had to eat this with my fingers. And the cheese was hot. Parked on the like beach parking lot, the gravel area where I usually am, but like this is on the other side. <sighs> is there anything else I can talk to you guys about? I'm trying to think. It's a cute duck. I don't know. I saw some cute seagulls today, guys. I'm obsessed with seagulls. I think seagulls are, like, my favorite animal. I know, it's kind of weird to have a seagull as a favorite animal, right? Excuse me. But they just are. They're super cute. You know? I don't Can hear the birds. I think I'm next to like a couple of birds or something. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, guys, it's a kind of a messy video. Seagull right here. Oh, 
probably gonna stop and think I'm gonna give him food. I should have never did that call. There's another one showing up. No, 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 don't come over here. I don't know if you guys can see them back there. And you can hear them. You can hear it mighty fine. All eight today, guys. It's like six o'clock now. What time is it? Six twenty-five. All I had today was a bagel for breakfast, and that's pretty much it. So, yeah. That was pretty much it. So I'm definitely hungry. But I feel like I'm rushing to eat. Can you slow down? My stomach's feeling queasy. Not like queasy, but it's feeling funny. Like, you know when, you, when you're eating too quick? I need to slow down. Put this down. Slow down. Whoa. So many ducks are flying right now, guys. Geese, I think they're geese. Geese, yeah. Yeah. With the big long necks. The... Yeah. You guys know what a geese is. A goose. Excuse me. Sorry. Um, yeah, I guess, sorry, excuse me, that's pretty much, I need to slow down, let my food come into me slowly, I guess, I don't know, again, my eyebrows are always a hot fucking mess, what's new, Keep. I need to get them waxed, but since I don't really go out, I just feel like there's no need, no, I don't know, I need to, but I will eventually, um, yeah. Let's see if I can take one more bite. I'm thinking if I should stay this up for home, but then it'll be hot and it's soggy, so I don't know. I feel like lately, I feel like everyone has a kid. Has a kid, is pregnant, one of the two. That's just pretty much what it is. And I don't know how I feel. I feel pressured to have one myself because of how everybody's having it. But I know that I am just not ready for one you know I don't know is it normal do people have kids in their 20s like super young 20 like in their 20s I'm 23 and there's people who I went to high school with who are having kids who had kids even early who are even younger than me crazy part of me doesn't want, I mean part of me doesn't want to have any till like I'm 30 or maybe at least 27 26 my later years because 30 is not too old I mean I want to enjoy life a little bit without kids with somebody that I'm with or something you know at least not with kids of my own if they have kids okay but like for my own I don't, I don't know guys but then part of me just wants to have some and then part of me is thinking maybe I don't want any I don't know I think I do want some I know I do I just do you not have a cute little baby of your own No. I think that would be cute. What do you guys think? Right over. I'm not ready for one right now.
I'm not. Every time I hang out with somebody who has a kid, it just reminds me of like it's not time yet. You know, because it's nice that this, when you have when you watch someone's kid or you with a kid, it's nice to have them back to parent. You know, I'm still young, so you know, there's no need to rush into having a kid. That's the way I see it. This is going to be my last bite. I'm getting so full. Mm -hmm. oh, so full. Look, more napkins to collect. And keep them in my handy dandy collecting spot. So the total of all this, the fries themselves were $5.99. And the total came out to six forty nine. Taxes fifty cents. I love Oregon. There's no taxes there. Oh. Makes life so much easier. So, um, oops. I keep dropping my shit everywhere. So yeah, like. I don't know how I feel about the kid thing. Excuse me. Sorry. Part of me wants to have kids. But then part of me is also like... Like, I want kids, I too. But I want to be more financially stable. You know, I want to be in a stable relationship. I don't want to just have kids with somebody... Like, random. Call me traditional, I guess this is what it is. Because... You know, traditional, old-fashioned. I want to be married first, and then I want to have kids. You know, I want to be in a stable environment. That's what I've always wanted. You know, the old-fashioned, traditional way of, you know, you get married, you have kids. That's how it is. It was, at least. And now people are just having kids without even being married, and I don't know how I feel about that. Like, I mean, part of me is like, it's okay because you know you don't because I've seen a lot of marriages that don't work out as well you know I've seen where one partner is not happy or they're both not happy and you know then you're stuck in a marriage and it's hard it is hard to get a divorce sometimes from from what I've heard you know it's it's not always peaches and cream you know so and then also part of me is thinking like maybe you know I don't need a marriage title to be with somebody you know I don't need to be married because after seeing all these people who are married go through horrible things makes me think you know I don't I don't want to get married I don't want to like have that entitlement I don't know guys it's a very confusing thing I think the answer to this is I won't know until I meet somebody who's special then I'll know what I want then I'll know if for example if he were to propose to me I would know yes or no or if I didn't want to get married I would tell him that I'm just I don't want to you know have that marriage title like it's just I feel like it's sometimes I feel like it's a lot of pressure I don't know guys I don't know how this topic went from babies to marriage to a whole bunch of things like I don't know I just love doing videos in the car I feel like it's I feel like it's more like I hate using the word authentic because it reminds me of Amberlynn Reed or whatever but it's just I feel like everything's just more cozy more comfy I'm by myself you know at home I feel like somebody's always watching me I know it's kind of weird right but like I just in the car, like, I just, I feel so relaxed just sitting here talking to you guys. If somebody's watching me, they're probably thinking I'm a freaking weirdo, but I'm kind of secluded somewhere next to a bush. That's so why you can see kind of like this, too. Well, that's, that's the car thing, but like, if you go like this, you can see a little bit of the bush reflections. Anyways, um, I don't know, I do want to go more into depth about this, and I probably will. Sorry for my hair, guys. It was really cute earlier, but all those wind at the beach made it all poofy like a poof ball and it's just gonna, gone crazy so if i remember i will include the miles i've walked today and the steps that i took today all while at the beach which wasn't too bad next time i'm gonna come with zeus i think or junior i don't know which one um and i want to try to go get like a lot of good miles and i'm just i'm just afraid to walk alone on the beach sometimes on the trails because i've you know there's been posts I've, I've talked about this before people have posted where they were attacked by somebody like a female was attacked by a male while walking on the beach trail or something so i'm afraid of that and i'm, I'm definitely afraid to go hiking by myself 
I'm afraid that a bear is gonna pop out. I'm afraid something's gonna come pop out and eat me. That somebody is gonna kill me. But I'm more afraid of a bear. Bear, of a bear. Sorry. I don't know. I'm, I'm getting way off topic, so I'm gonna end this now before I get more off topic. Maybe we can do like a random video of just talking with you guys sitting down like this or something in the car. Um, yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was a very good curly fries. I'll show you what I have left. I couldn't eat the rest. It's a lot. I don't know, maybe my mom will want it or something from my stepdad. I don't know. I'll just throw it out. And, you know, if they don't want it, I'll give it to my dogs they'll happily eat it but I think they'll eat it because they usually if I have leftovers they'll love to eat it like you know who doesn't want good leftovers I would love to have leftover french fries too myself if I, if I wasn't if I didn't eat them or whatever you know what I mean anyways anyways um I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you did please give it a thumbs up let me know what kind of crust you want guys but I'm trying I'm thinking about going vegan low vegetarian for a month so today's May 2nd the videos that you'll be seeing before this You'll see. You'll be seeing some videos in, in, I think in May. I think up till May seventh, you'll be seeing some videos or something. It'll be me eating meat product. So with you know, meat for like a McDonald's or whatever. But that th those are all pre-recorded. So all those videos are pre-recorded. This is gonna be pre-recorded too. But it's May second. So I'm starting May second today. I'm going to try not eat meat for a month and just see how that goes. Cause. Honestly, I just want to stop eating meat, but I feel so judged if I if I do that, you know I don't know. I just and I feel like it'll be healthier for me, too I feel like I'll get healthier. I'll lose weight fast, you know faster And I won't be spending as much as money as I do when you have to get that because when you go somewhere to eat What are you gonna get? There's not a lot of vegan options or something. I don't know That video from Chantel really made me sad with that earthling video guys it's sad. Maybe I'll link it below if I remember. Anyways, okay, I'm done. So, I love you guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in another video.